In this video, I'm going to show you how to add and delete cases from your project. In this project, we have five cases. If you'd like to add a case, you can do it in one of two ways. You can move your mouse into the Cases window and right-click. Then select Add Case from the menu. Alternatively, you can move up to Cases in the menu at the top of the screen, select it, and then scroll down to Add. An Add New Case dialog box appears. This dialog box lists all of the variables that we see in the left-hand side in the Variables window. We can go ahead and populate these variables. Our project is on elementary education, so these variables refer to a student interview. Our student's name is Lori B, and her age is 8. Her gender is female, and her grade is 5. To populate the interview variable, which is a document variable, you can select F2 or you can double click beside the interview variable. There are two ways to populate this document variable. You can manually type it in or you can move to the folder at the top of the dialog box and import your document. You may have to change your file type in order to see your document. Once you found your document, simply select it, and your document is imported. From here, there's no need to save, simply close the dialog box. And once you're done, select OK. We can see that the new case, Lori B, has been added to our list of cases. Deleting a case from your project is very simple. You can do it in two ways. You can select the case you'd like to delete and right-click your mouse and then scroll down to Delete Cases. You can also move to Cases at the top of the screen and scroll down to Delete Cases. A dialog box opens up listing all of your cases with the currently selected case checked. Check the cases that you would like to delete. You can delete more than one at a time. In this case, we're only going to delete the one case and then select OK. Our case has been deleted from our list of cases.